I feel like we're gonna about to bring this down by the weight of these people here. So I gotta have like really thin people using this. Can you please make it. Oh, <gasps> we got the star. Oh no! <laughs> we we got one through. Oh god, everybody's going down. Oh god, everybody's going down. Don't make it, buddy. Oh Jesus! I told you guys. I told you. What is going on, everybody? Welcome to Carried Away. I'm your host, the Birdman Otis Falcon. Now, this right here is something I've been keeping my eye on for a while. This is very similar, very familiar to you if you played something like a Poly Bridge. If you're familiar with Poly Bridge, it's a really wacky physics, like, you know, bridge building game, I suppose, where essentially you're on the fly building bridges in order to get vehicles from one area to the other one, making sure the people along the way don't die a horrible dead because you're a terrible bridge builder. Or here in Carried Away, you're kind of doing the same thing except you're messing around with skiers, you're in control of building all that stuff, and we'll have a bunch of like small objectives here and there in order for us to meet. But it's a really silly game, really fun, especially if you like something like Poly Bridge. I think you'll enjoy this one here. So, let's get to it. Um, this will be our starting point, and essentially we gotta drag a line from here till the end, right? Now, let's go ahead and just do that without any sort of item placed here in between to show that off. And what's gonna happen? Well, we got no... Wait a minute. Oh! <laughs> oh, God! I was about to say, are we about to really clear this without, like, you know, any sort of, like, you know, support? And it's it's funny because... Oh, no! <gasps> that guy just slid his head on that sign! No, not you two! Okay, that guy, he just broke his neck. Okay, well, th that's what happens when you come to the Falcon Resort. The Ski Resort. You wind up with a broken head and a bunch of gashes. Oh, God. So... Obviously, we need to do something over here to make sure that they don't die here. This is the really big problem, so here's gonna be our building area. Let's start off with some planks. Um, eventually, we get some logs, but these logs are sturdier, but they also cost a lot more. So if you're trying to keep your, your, your I guess, your total spending low, um, you might want to use planks instead. Although, at the moment, the game is blocking us off for the first level. So let's go ahead and uh, remove you out of the equation here. Let's go to the planks now. The common building thing the game will tell you to do is to always use triangles. Triangles are very sturdy, very supportive. We're gonna try to keep this as cheap as possible. We have a thousand dollar spending limit, but the less money you do it in, the better you do in the rankings as well. So let's start off by just doing something like... I don't know, we'll do something like that. And then something like that. Okay, can you connect from here to there? Yes, you can. And how about we do something sturdy like here? Okay. Now, I'm gonna do it this way, just to see if I can keep it really, really cheap. Chances are, though, based on the height, I feel like they'll still end up clipping themselves over here, like, just barely. Like, the weight... Their weight should probably hit the sign still. I'm trying to keep this really cheap thing. I don't have to, I could actually use more. So, you see? Yep! <laughs> that freaking sign right there. Can't we just... How about this, guys? How about we just remove the sign? Huh? Anybody ever thought about that idea? It'd be great. So let's come over here and remove you, because we don't need you here. Um, and let's remove that. So, with that being said, we need to go higher. So let's move you, like, up to here. And maybe you up like so. Up like so. And again, we want some support. Let's see how this bad boy does for us now. And I'll place you through here. Now. Keep in mind that right now we're not noticing it, but if I fail or something breaks, then we'll be able to see if something is more stronger in one side than the other. So, you see how everything's green right now? Oh yeah, we could also zoom around and check from the other angles. Oh, we cleared it! Just barely, but we cleared it. But I like this feature right here, we can just zoom on in and see what's happening. Made it through. Ah, look at that guy, he's so happy! Yeah! I made it over here in one single piece, Falcon didn't kill me this time, yeah? Enjoy it, guys! Enjoy it. You made it in one single piece. I believe we should be able to move, like, somewhere over there. Okay, well, either way, we're done. And I love the fact you can zoom around and check out everything from every single angle, but if any of these bars would turn red, it means that there's just way too much pressure, and meaning that it's gonna probably cave in on you, so... Green is the ideal one. Yellow means, like, hey, you know what? You probably need a bit more support over here, be really careful, but for the most part, that went pretty good. Alrighty guys, so here we have Rowanit. For this one, we have a new objective. So for this one, it's going to be, um, without any breakages, obviously. We have a 3,000 spending limit. 
We also have to make sure that we don't kill anybody, which is always a good thing, and we also have to collect all the stars. Luckily for us in this level, there's only one of them, but for some of them down the line, we'll have more stars that we have to collect, and sometimes you have to use the skiers to like take off from a lift, go in the air and do a couple of flips to grab something, so it depends on how well you build the bridge. So for this one, we have to collect this bad boy right here. We have a couple of building spots here, 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 and we have um, the three skiers over here just waiting to possibly die in my little death trap here. So let's go and start building if we can. Uh, we have a three spotter here. Do we have to use all three of them? I probably not, but I, I think I probably will just to make sure that we have a sturdy foundation. This tree seems to be in the way, so that's going to be the big problem child over here. I guess we'll start off by... Yeah, I guess we'll start off over here. So let's find out about this plank going up this way. And you can't reach that way. So instead, no, no, no. No, my friend, you will be deleted. Let's go ahead and um, lean you a bit forward if we can, just enough to reach. Okay. And then we'll come up through here. Through here. We gotta make sure that we clear this tree up here. And you'll be the support for that guy. Okay. Now let's see how do I want to play this sound. Do you reach over there? Yes, you do. Um... You gotta get enough height to clear this tree is my big problem. So what if I add something like here and then we move you upwards? Like so? And then another one here. Another one here. So is this going to be sturdy enough for maybe a wheel, I wonder? Let's find out. I'm going to add a wheel right here, and let's see if that works. And then we'll add the linkage over here. So now we have to connect that to here. So we'll come up to this side and we'll do something like it. This is kind of really weird because of that weird angle, so... I hope I don't... Oh boy, that could be a problem. Um, no, no, no. No. I, I don't like what I've done here. Co no, don't copy. Don't, don't, don't copy the freaking thing because I don't like it. Delete it. Out of the way. Delete! I'm like Matt Hardy right now. Oh, yeah, it's brilliant. Anyway, wonderful. Pretty sure a lot of people have no idea what I'm talking about right now. But that's okay. You just haven't been exposed to the broken brilliance just yet. Uh, let's see. Especially if you only really watch WWE. You probably won't be seeing broken Matt Hardy. But that's, that's another story for wrestling nerds like me, apparently. Alright, so we'll do something like that, like that, and like this. Now, let's see if this works. Chances are I probably won't. I don't like my... Yeah, I don't like this over here. This part really worries me. Like, I feel like we should have a connection to that, which I'm not seeing it. So, oh, oh boy. Oh boy. That's no good. Remove you. What if we instead do something like... Alright, what if I bring you up towards, like, here? Here? And then we... Will that hold? It feels like this might not hold. Okay, we'll do that. Let's put this wheel here. That should be enough height. Or do you have to go higher? I think you might have to go higher. All right, let's try this out, though. Oh, no, no, that might be just enough. Maybe the head? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe the head will do it. Start it off. Okay. Something's gonna break right now. I just know it. I know something's gonna break. Let's zoom on in. Oh, okay. No, clear the tree. No, the tree! The tree! Oh, no. Oh, he kept on. No, but not the star. The star. We didn't catch the star. <laughs> That's actually kind of good, though. You know what this means? It means that we have enough to clear the tree, which is really dangerous because they're touching it, but that's going to keep my building cost low. What we got to do, though, is just make sure that this goes a bit higher, and then we're just getting a bit more of that. And by going higher here, we might also clear this tree without a problem. So do I want that metal? Absolutely, I do. So stop this here. Um, you could go away for now. This could throw everything off now, keep in mind. But that should be enough to pick that star up. Now, are you gonna be sturdy enough is my question with the weight coming up. You see how this is yellow? I don't like it. I feel like we're gonna about to bring this down by the weight of these people here. So I gotta have like really thin people using this. Can you please make it? Oh, <gasps> we got the star. Oh no! <laughs> we, we got one through. Oh God, everybody's going down. Oh god, everybody's going down. Don't make it, buddy. Oh, Jesus. I told you guys. I told you. It's You see that red part right there? That's a problem. So we need to fortify that a little bit more. Um, perhaps even by moving the wheel over there and having the weight distributed over on that side instead. So, okay. That, that seems very dangerous, and I feel like this is even worse than my other idea. Oh, that's gonna be worse, isn't it? It's totally worse. I can speed this up, mind you. 
Zoom out. Uh, look at all that yellow. Look at all that yellow. Right now, the weight's gonna just bring them all down. Watch, I know it's gonna happen. Oh! <laughs> oh, you see that red over here? Okay. Is that the only thing that's really holding me back, that red one? Because if so, can't we just do something like at this through here? Will that make it... Oh, that could just do it right there alone. Maybe. Okay, let's see. Oh, there's some clippage happening right there. But oh, it's enough for us to do it! We got the star, we got the people through. Oh, I hope nobody weighs a bit more than they have to. Oh, yes, we got it, baby! <laughs> no debts this time in a Falcon debt trip. Good, get, get over there, yeah! All right, and we spent 1853, we had a 3,000 spending limit, so we went over maybe like 55 or 60% of our spending budget, which is pretty good. Let's go to the next one over. How did we do on that one? Let me look at my rank. It's 16! Hey, that's not too bad. I'll take a 16. I'll absolutely take a 16. All right, let's go over here with Green Run. This is another a lift, huh? I really want to show you guys the... the swoo! And by the swoo, I mean the... The ski lifts, is what I call it. Or not the ski lifts, but the bridges with the skiers. I call them the swoos for some particular reason or another. We do have to get another star over here. We have a tree on this side. This seems a bit more basic, I would say. Let's hope that... Let, let me complete this one. If with any luck, we'll get the next one as the bridge building. If we don't get the bridge building, I'll jump over to the tutorial. We can see the bridge building in action. So, um, let's try to get this one in as soon as possible. Well, how, much, how much is my spending limit? Um, no limit, really. No limit records. Master P. Collect all the stars. Don't kill anybody. And, oh. Well, I mean, if I gotta worry about money, then what's stopping me? Here, connect that. Connect that. Okay. Huh. That's a really high-angled star, to be honest with you. Fairly high-angled. So much, in fact, that I'm, I'm slightly worried about how the hell am I gonna get up there. Hmm. Okay, well, let's just continue building this way. I guess we'll just go really, really high up and hope for the best, huh? What's the worst that could possibly happen when you go really, really high up in Falcon's Dead Trip? Well, you know, I got an idea. I got a good idea what would happen here, so let's put... Uh, I don't know, you through here. How would the rope work? <laughs> I have a feeling we should probably use this guy to get some of the weight distributed over here, because I have a feeling it'll just come down through here and just... Okay, well, this is going to be really fun, I imagine. This is not how you should complete this, I am 100% I'm certain. You see the weight over in the yellow? Oh my god, we couldn't even get the regular thing alone. It was just way too much. Now, how do I feel about this giant colossus over here? Well, <laughs> I feel like it seems a bit sturdier, because now I've used all three of the building things to give it me. So this one might, might do it. Well, we'll see. Either that, or people are gonna fall from really high and up, and they're gonna be really upset when they die. Oh god. Oh, oh no. It's just a bit too heavy up top, right? So we gotta, like, maybe fortify it. It does seem like this over here might hold. So, perhaps if we go ahead and we do something like a bit more reinforcements through that side. Could perhaps be the piece that we need, and then maybe... Maybe something like that? Maybe? Let's try this one here. Oh, oh, mama. <laughs> oh, no, look at that red right there. Oh, this human's gonna bring everything down. It's just too high up. Okay, let's try it this way. I feel like maybe if I, if this fails, we could just add another plank over here to fortify this area. Because it's it's down here, the big problem child. I want to say, oh! Oh, did we just do it? Oh, baby, we finally did it. We got, we got to get a couple more of them over. Oh! <gasps> We had a breakage! I told you guys, I... How is that even holding? You know what, I'm actually even more surprised by the fact that this held with a broken part. Like, this has to be like the most unsafe ski lift of all time, and somehow, it worked. I didn't get the breakage right there. That's very easily done though, as I mentioned, all I really have to do is add like another piece from... You know how this broke? We just need a piece right here to here. It's a matter of fact, let's do it right now. Speed up a simulation. There it is, you see that now? No breakage, no breakage, oh baby, no breakage. So that's all we have to do, just add one more of those there. No breaking, we got everything done. <laughs> Nobody died, got the star, everything worked now, it's swell. Next one over, how did I do with this one here? I'm at 31st, not really too happy with 31st, but I'll accept it for now because I gotta do a bit more. So, oh, you know what, here we go. 
No, that doesn't tell me. Uh, oh, here, that's a, that's a ski level right here. Can I skip over to that? Oh, that's the next one. Little Bridge Hill, perfect. Let's do this one and then we wrap it up because I wanted to actually show one of these off here. Okay, so, um, well, what the hell is this? Who, who, who are you talking to me about? You should have build a bridge when you don't have enough speed. You should build a bridge when you don't have enough speed to jump over a gap. Okay. You can toggle the grid on and off using G if you want to fine-tune your constructions. Uh-huh. <laughs> so you, you want me to do that now, huh? Now the grid's off now. Um, so where's the, where's the end point here? Oh, just that right here, huh? So... Just a bridge over on this side, they gotta jump it over. I see. Okay. So, <laughs> this is going to be something here. Um, so you're going to be coming down this way. And we just got to get you through. This should not be a big problem, right? I mean, come on, Falcon, for real. You, you, you tell me you can't do this one. You got you got this one, right, Bar? You got this, right? I mean, how do I even... No, we need some... need some support down here, though. So, um, okay. Let, let's have the support first. How about that? Now, you're going to be coming down this way. So can I put the support down through here? Oh, I can. Absolutely, I can. So let's see about the jump itself. So from here down to that, okay. Um, this might be prob <laughs> this might be problematic. Um, hold on to that, right? And oh boy, like what I would like to do is to get you to like you know lift upwards, but that's a really bad angle for a, a lift upwards thing, you know. So instead, we'll have you keep going down a bit further. Can you connect to that? Yes, you can. We also need a connection down to here, though. Oh, you could go really far down, though. Oh, okay. So you guys, how far do you go down? That's that's good. It's better than the planks, then. I got you. So, I mean, it's still going to be kind of really dodgy. Let, let's see how this works. Do you at least stay on is my question for now? I mean, he's not going to make it whatsoever. He's going <laughs> to fall down. <laughs> why would you even go at it? Like, why would you stop yourself at this point and be like, you know what? This is like a terrible idea. I should just really, really stop. Uh, but you know what? I don't control these guys. They do what they feel like. So, what if we do something like here to here? And do you connect to that? So that should still be slightly all right. And then we'll have... Should I just literally build a bridge? This doesn't seem like we're getting enough like momentum downward to then like swoosh upwards, you know? Or maybe we, maybe we can't. I don't know. Maybe I'm just... I'm going to try to get in the swoosh. If not, I'll just build a bridge straight up. How about that? I'm not excited about the idea of just doing it that way, but... In order to get him across in one single piece, I would like to keep this fine gentleman alive. I mean, he's done nothing to me for me to wish him any ill. So... Okay, let's, um... Do one more over here. Now, obviously... Oh, oh! <laughs> that should probably not hold. Considering that's just, you know, on that one side here. But what if we do something like through here? Uh-huh. And then... <laughs> okay, this is actually... This might actually work. As, as, as grotesque as this thing looks, it might work. It, this might actually just tumble about over here too, but this might work otherwise. Now, if I hold S, he'll crouch and then... Yes, baby! <laughs> he made it! See, my goal was to do this without building a bridge all the way across. I wanted to see the little swoosh, and we saw the swoosh. As a matter of fact, can you um swoosh one more time, my friend? Now, what's cool is you actually control the, the skier, so if you hold S like I'm doing right now down, he's crouching. And then at the height of the jump, oh, something broke this time, which it did not break last time, so that's pretty intriguing. So by using the momentum of the jump that I made him with um, W, it did break some of my bridge off. That's really intriguing, though. And then you could also use um, A and D to make him lean back or forward, depending on how you want him landing. So if you gotta make a perfect landing, that could work out that way too. Hey, hey, hey. Now let's be honest here. I beat this without having it break the first time, so can you... I'll just have you lean forward, maybe, on your way down? Don't break anything. Oh! <laughs> it's the smallest little jumpable time. So, let's go over to the next. What, what rank did I get for that one? Pretty terrible, I would say, right? 23! Hey, back to Michael Jordan's number. All right, you know what? There you guys go. So this is um, Carried Away. Really fun, really wacky game. If you would like to see a bit more, you know what to do. You let me know in the comments. You let me know by leaving a thumbs up. And we might cover more of this bad boy here down the line. We have the mound. Why are some of them blocked and some of them are not? 
Huh, it seems to be depending on which path you take, you unlock something to the next one. So that's pretty intriguing, I like that. So from over here, you could actually go this way, that way, or this way. So that might be like a downhill level. Ooh, that sounds fun. Well, there you guys have it. I hope you enjoyed it. I will catch you next time.